Ever felt like anger controls you instead of the other way around? What if I told you that by adopting a few simple habits, you could master your anger and turn it into a source of strength? In today's fast-paced world, it's easy to get frustrated, irritated, or downright angry. But what if there was a way to not only manage these emotions, but actually release them in a way that leads to personal growth? In this video, we're diving into seven powerful habits inspired by Stoic philosophy that can help you control and release anger. Stick around, and by the end, you'll have the tools to transform anger into calmness, clarity, and resilience. Number one, Stoicism in managing anger. Stoicism teaches that anger, while natural, is not something to be suppressed or ignored but rather understood and managed with wisdom. The first step in managing anger, according to Stoic philosophy, is to acknowledge it without judgment. This means recognizing anger as an emotional response that signals something is wrong, rather than immediately reacting to it. By acknowledging your anger in this way, you gain a moment of clarity an opportunity to pause and reflect on the true cause of your frustration. This reflection is crucial because it allows you to differentiate between what is within your control and what is not. The Stoics emphasize that our emotions, including anger, are often reactions to external events that we cannot control. However, what we can control is how we choose to respond. When you acknowledge your anger without letting it dictate your actions, you create a space between the initial stimulus and your response. This space is where wisdom can take root, guiding you to respond in a way that is measured, thoughtful, and aligned with your values. Instead of being consumed by anger, you use it as a tool for introspection and growth ultimately transforming a potentially destructive emotion into one that fosters resilience and self-mastery. Number two, mindfulness and breath control. When anger arises, our body's natural response is often to enter a state of heightened arousal, triggering the fight or flight response. This reaction manifests through shallow, rapid breathing, which in turn, exacerbates feelings of anger and stress. Mindfulness and breath control offer a powerful antidote to this cycle. By intentionally slowing down your breath, you signal to your body that it's safe to relax, which calms the nervous system and reduces the intensity of your anger. This practice of mindfulness, being fully present in the moment with your breath, shifts your focus away from the trigger of your anger and anchors you in the here and now. As you breathe deeply and steadily, you create a space between the emotion and your reaction, giving you the clarity to choose a more measured response. This simple yet profound habit not only helps you manage anger in the moment, but also trains your mind to remain composed and centered in future situations. By mastering your breath, you take control of your emotional state, transforming potential outbursts into opportunities for calm and thoughtful action. Number three, impermanence and coping with change. Understanding impermanence is a powerful tool in managing anger because it shifts our perspective from attachment to acceptance. The Stoics believe that much of our suffering comes from resisting the natural flow of life, holding on to things, people, or situations that are by nature transient. When we grasp that everything is temporary, we begin to see our emotions, including anger, in a different light. Anger often feels overwhelming in the moment, but by reminding ourselves that this emotion, like all others, will pass, we can detach from it and observe it without being consumed. This doesn't mean we suppress our anger. Rather, we acknowledge it and allow it to flow through us, understanding that it is a fleeting state. 
By embracing the impermanence of life, we become more resilient and less reactive, able to navigate challenges with a sense of calm and clarity. This perspective helps us release the need to control every outcome, fostering a mindset of peace and acceptance even in the face of adversity. Number four, practicing patience. Patience is a profound practice that goes beyond simply waiting. It's about cultivating the inner strength to maintain composure in the face of life challenges. The Stoics understood that life is full of unexpected events, many of which are beyond our control. By embracing patience, we acknowledge that these disruptions are a natural part of existence. When confronted with situations that provoke anger, patience allows us to pause and reflect before reacting. This brief moment of reflection can be transformative as it gives us the space to assess the situation more objectively. We can consider whether our anger is truly warranted or if it stems from our own expectations not being met. Often, when we allow ourselves this pause, we realize that the issue at hand is not as significant as it initially seemed and the anger dissipates on its own. Patience, therefore, not only helps us avoid unnecessary conflict, but also empowers us to respond with wisdom and clarity. It teaches us that enduring discomfort or delay with grace is a sign of strength, not weakness, and that true power lies in our ability to control our reactions rather than letting our emotions control us. By practicing patience, we can navigate life's inevitable frustrations with a sense of calm and resilience, ultimately leading to more peaceful and fulfilling interactions. Number five, forgiveness. Forgiveness, as the fifth habit, is a powerful tool in managing anger and achieving inner peace. When you hold on to anger, you're not just clinging to the initial hurt but allowing it to continually affect your emotional well-being. This anger can become a heavy burden, weighing you down and preventing you from moving forward. Forgiveness, however, is not about condoning or forgetting the wrongdoing. It's about choosing to let go of the resentment that keeps you tethered to the past. The Stoics saw forgiveness as a means of reclaiming your emotional freedom. By forgiving, you break the cycle of anger and pain, allowing yourself to heal and grow. This act of release not only lightens your emotional load, but also opens up space for positive energy, clarity, and peace of mind. Forgiveness transforms the energy that would have been spent on anger into a force for personal development, enabling you to live with a lighter heart and a more focused mind. Through forgiveness, you empower yourself to move beyond the hurt, fostering resilience and emotional strength in the process. Number six, releasing negative emotions. Releasing negative emotions is a fundamental aspect of mastering anger, as it allows us to clear the mental and emotional clutter that often clouds our judgment. The Stoics recognized that holding on to negative emotions, such as anger, resentment, or frustration, only serves to poison our minds and disrupt our inner peace. These emotions, when left unchecked, can lead to irrational decisions, strained relationships, and a cycle of negativity that erodes our well being. To break this cycle, it's essential to find healthy outlets for expressing and releasing these emotions. Journaling, for instance, provides a private space to process and understand your feelings, turning chaotic thoughts into structured insights. Talking to a trusted friend offers perspective and emotional support, helping to lighten the burden of what you're carrying. Physical activity, on the other hand, channels the energy of anger into something productive, reducing its intensity and bringing a sense of calm. By regularly practicing these habits, 
You create space within yourself for positivity, allowing clarity and calmness to take the place of anger and negativity. This shift not only helps you navigate challenging situations with a clear mind, but also fosters emotional resilience, enabling you to face life's difficulties with a balanced and composed demeanor. Number seven, self-control and personal growth. Self-control is the cornerstone of personal growth, and the Stoics understood this deeply. They taught that true power comes from mastering oneself rather than controlling external circumstances. When anger arises, it can feel overwhelming, often pushing us toward rash decisions or actions we later regret. However, by practicing self-control, you transform this volatile energy into a force for personal development. Each time you successfully manage your anger, you reinforce your ability to stay calm under pressure, making you more resilient in the face of future challenges. This practice of self-mastery doesn't just provide immediate relief from conflict. It gradually strengthens your character, enhancing your ability to navigate life's difficulties with wisdom and grace. Over time, this habit of self-control becomes a bedrock for long-term personal growth, helping you to not only manage your emotions, but to evolve into a stronger, more composed individual capable of turning obstacles into opportunities for self-improvement. Incorporating these seven habits into your daily life will help you not only manage, but release anger in a way that leads to inner peace and resilience. Remember, anger is not something to be feared or suppressed, but understood and transformed. By practicing stoic principles, you can turn what once felt like a weakness into a source of strength. If you found this video helpful, don't forget to give it a thumbs up and subscribe for more content on mastering your emotions and living a stoic life. And tell me in the comments, which habit will you start practicing today? Mastering anger is a lifelong journey, but with these habits, you're well on your way to living a calmer, more fulfilled life. Remember, the power to transform your anger is in your hands choose to act with wisdom and strength.